Spencer Matthews was hospitalized after affecting his liver function by taking too many cold sore pills, his wife Vogue Williams has claimed. The 37-year-old said that Spencer, 35, had also come down with a debilitating sickness bug the same week. She told all about the reality star's ordeal in a recent episode of her podcast, My Therapist Ghosted Me, which she co-hosts with Joanne McNally. Spenny was hospitalized for two days because he is a little bee and he can't handle it, she joked. Well, I will tell you what, he overdosed on cold sore tablets. I am not joking. Read now, Martine McCutcheon hospitalized on husband's birthday with chronic illness he overdosed on cold sore tablets and his liver function, was affected, because he did it for a full week, taking 10 of these things and he said, oh they're fine, Vogue exclaimed. The Dancing with the Stars contestant quipped that her husband had been equally keen to get her dose of the medication topped up too. He did it to me when I thought I felt a tingle and he said, darling, take six of these and you'll be fine, when, you're only meant to take two. She confided. The couple, who have three children together, Theodore, four, Gigi, three, and baby of the family Otto, 15 months, were then plagued by a sickness bug, complicating matters even further. Don't miss. Clarkson's farm star Caleb Cooper emotional as he shares devastating update, latest, Strictly's Bobby Brazier once begged fans to pay his rent dad Jeff charged him, revelation, 22 kids and counting Sue Radford undergoes dramatic hair transformation, pictures, Spencer revealed that doctors had suggested at one point that he had a problem with his liver, adding jokingly, even knowing that my liver is functioning is good news. The fact that my liver was even able to become ill meant that it still existed after all those years of boozing, he chuckled on their joint podcast. Meanwhile, Vogue, who was previously married to Westlife's Brian McFadden for three years, has a history of being prone to getting bugs on holiday. The same problem happened less than a year ago leaving her feeling horrendously ill, while she was previously also struck down by the norovirus on a skiing holiday with friends. Meanwhile, the pair clarified this month that they have committed to making time for each other in the bedroom, no matter how hectic their lifestyle as parents of three boisterous children might become. Vogue read out a statistic on the couple's podcast suggesting that couples are having sex less than ever before, and 30% less than their parents. Spencer quickly retorted, not in our house. It's going to upset a lot of parents, but, we have sex quite a lot, don't we? We're on a real hot streak. He added that daily sex is a norm for them, only for Vogue to joke that if he continued discussing their intimate life with the public, he would be heading for a cold streak instead. Now take